Several recent incidents involving online threats spread on various social media platforms have raised concerns among parents in the Robbinsdale School District. However, many of the threats turn out to be unfounded. We sat down with Robbinsdale Police to learn more about how these threats are handled. At their core, schools are designed to be places where young minds can learn the fundamental building blocks to set them up for future success. But these days, schools find themselves occasionally having to send out messages to parents who address threats made on social media, such as this recent one from Robbinsdale Middle School about a weapon possibly being brought into the building. We did receive a call from a parent uh, that one of their uh, children that goes to RMS had received a threat through social media. Captain Shad Stensrud of the Robbinsdale Police Department says that with this case and every online threat, they first try to determine its credibility. There's a lot, so much that goes on in social media and you, you really don't know what is true and what's not. In this instance, they contacted school administrators and worked hand in hand with them on the investigation to identify who's in the post. Then they got the parents involved. In this case, Luckily, like many others, it was found to be that it wasn't even a student that goes to RMS. Um, so then we just went from there. Meanwhile, Stensrud says the nature of these social media threats can range from being specific to vague. So sometimes it can be a certain day and time, or sometimes it can just be, I'm just going to generally go do something at any given with no specifics. So, so yeah, they can be broad or they can be specific. Um, we've seen we've seen both. But these threats can not only cause people to be alarmed, they can also have negative consequences for the youth making the threats. It's why he urges parents to talk to their kids about what they post or see online. Even if they don't want to get their friends in trouble or whatever, it's just uh, it's just better if they see something that. Um, that could be threatening to anybody that they would just notify their parents or school staff. The Robbinsdale School District, meanwhile, recently approved a change to its weapons policy requiring building administrators to report to police as soon as possible any firearms related incident. Find more local news stories at ccxmedia.org and follow us on social media.